thought you came here to see Foxy. Want a closer look? Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh! Whoa! Hello everybody, my name is Crispy and welcome to Tale- Welcome back to Tales of the Bunny Man, right? So, last episode, right? Um, one kid went missing. Um, from what I remember, one kid went missing. We saw Bonnie, Foxy, and Chica. And that's about it, right? So, yeah, let's get into it. <laughs> okay, now we got four which is active. So we have Bonnie, who shows up at the door. Chiku shows up at the door. Foxy, who you can hear him running. You get to hide in the present. Ready. Come on, wake up already. There you go. Hi hey. <laughs> Should I do a voice? It'll be easier. <clears throat> what? If I do it, I'm going to do the stupid candy voice I had in the other one. There you go. Hey, puppet. I'm going to need you for something. If they won't go to bed on their own, I'll make them. <laughs> yes, no power means no arcades, no TV, and no jukebox. And they'll have no choice but to finally go to bed. Hello, is someone in there? Oh. Uh. <laughs> um, I don't have a voice for this. Foxy was wondering where you uh, where you went, so he asked me to go look out. What are you doing here anyway? Uh, huh? What are you doing on the floor? Are we digging for treasure? I love digging for treasure. I love digging. It's so fun. It's... Yep, can't see that. Turn down, turn down your flashlight. It's like I'm being, I'm looking at the sun. Please, Sparky. Sparky? So Sparky's the other character? Or what? Okay, so Freddy will wind up the music box. Oh, he'll turn off the power, but you have to flash him with your light. Oh, ho, 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 ho. So he'll wind the box, and he'll... Okay, he'll wind the box, and he'll do something to the power in the box. The power box in the other room. Don't forget your cameras. Dude, I, I want to make that Pop Goes video so bad, you have no idea. But I need to do it right, you know? It can be my, like, one and only time to bring people in here. Okay, so that's Golden Fred, or Fred Bear, right? We're all in agreement on that? That's Fred Bear, literally? Click and hold. Ah, uh, everybody's out. Oh, Freddy. Big buddy. Okay, so I've been holding control this entire time thinking I needed to. But you just have to you just have to press control. That's Foxy. Not hot. Where's Freddy at? Freddy, where even like where even is Freddy? Also, this is like signi- He's in the other room. Oh! Wait. No, wait, but I need to go in there, right? Ah, it looks like I did it. But you look at that. I'm so goaded. Foxy, so close. Way too close. Freddy, don't look at me like that.
This is Skeet Hansen from the Predatorial Investigation Unit. You've just been skeeted in 4K. Right, you won't be taking me today, buddy. I gotta send you all back to the realm you came from. The really lanky domain that you came from. Bro, Foxy. Yo. Oh, I'm cooked. 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 Wait. Yo, I uh, I couldn't tell you what was going on. Got a lot of audio cues here. Hey Chica, you spawned in. What in the world? I have like nothing to say because I have to focus. Wait, look, focus, guys. Usually this will be the next this one up. I want Freddy's nowhere to be seen, by the way. Just a thought, you know, like you would hope that the you know the main guy just be right there. And he's not. Whew. Please, game. Let's go. I don't know how that was going to go. Because I couldn't. I didn't think I was going to be able to listen for the thing. Tomorrow is another day. I seriously had I, I had to eat that like it was light work. Also, I'm not doing voices for humans anymore because half the characters are actually like either women or I just can't tell what they are. Or I just I, I'm just not I'm just not doing voices. <clears throat> hey, you two want to want to maybe draw something? All right, I haven't even done voices. I'm already screwing up English. All right, sounds good, Fritz. You in? But I want to see Captain. But I want to see Captain Foxy today. It's been a long time since we saw him. Later, Fritz. We'll do it later. Okay. Okay, I'm assuming, right? <laughs> Critical thinking would tell me that don't go to the... I'll be... Well, Pyro Boy. I'm just... Huh. Well, Pyro Boy. Just mopping the deck that is Freddy's Pizza. Who be ye? Larry the Janitor. That's me. Larry Strode? Have you... Wait, what? Have, have you spied Captain Foxy? Oh, Foxy's on vacation at the moment. We have to have him back soon. If you anything cleaned up, don't make yourself stranger. No poisonous frog person, it's nothing. That seems like a reference. Oh, hey, Fritz, what you doing? Just came here to see my favorite trio. Still talking like a pirate, even after Ash told you to stop. Our our teacher's a dingus. They don't know they don't know about the pirate lifestyle. That's so real, bro. As soon as I started watching One Piece, I had to stop showering. <laughs> Those two things are totally not connected. <laughs> <laughs> if you say so. I'll be ye. Swell, a little scared too. My dad told me to keep an eye on the strangers. On strangers with that weird security guard. They could be dangerous. Yeah, Mr. Mr. Bond is what Captain Foxy would call a drunken sailor. What does that mean, dude? 
<laughs> You're a goofball, Fritz. What are you doing? I came to see Freddy. Some people have been saying I look like him. <laughs> okay. Now that you mention it, it should be the opposite. He looks like me. <laughs> yeah, Freddy looks like you. Have you spy Captain Foxy? No, just stop by. Aw, oh, shucks. I have to go home. E I have to go home, even. I think I forgot to feed Looney. Looney? Who the hell be Looney? <laughs> oh, it's my bird. I brought him to class once. Oh, yeah, him. I'm glad that the all, like, bye. I'm glad that all the kids actually know each other, so it makes them feel, you know. Is this? All right. He just won't listen. Ahoy. Wow, he, hey, kid. You looking for something? I'll be. If you want to kid, not great, but, uh, Vincent, I mean the security guard, has been having too much evil juice. And he's been- evil juice? He's been acting aggressive, even. He's been acting aggressive, even. It's too much after these past days. I gotta learn how to speak English before I start reading dialogue-heavy games. I see. How about we change topics? What are you doing? Well, we have a discount for Chica's Master Chicken Burger. Bonnie's Ultimate Salmon Burger. And Chica's Fiery Thai Chicken Salad. Would you like some? Oh, thanks. Oh, that's okay. Have you seen Foxy? Let's just... Sorry, kid. Our boss told us he went on vacation to Spain. Alright. Hope he gets back soon so he can entertain happy campers like you. Alright, fair enough. I mean, that's literally only fair. Alright, we're triple double here. We're just... Looks like a train conductor. <laughs> I'll be ye. Ha ha ha. I spy you're a jolly today, maybe. Who be ye? You know me, what? Okay. Alright. We would be ye idle in land lumber. Alright, bro. I'm not I'm not gonna read all of those ha's, bro. Mike and I think it's Rita. She's been acting too weird. In a way she's doing Jody Winstone. In a way she's there's so many names. In a way she's doing this, Baker. We work with her 24-7. You and that Afton kid have been smoking po wow. Alright. Sorry, Miss Winstone. I read the plain fingers. I'm pointing at Mr. Emily. How come? How often do you see him around, Roy? Really think about it. The only time he shows up is when one of the kids go missing. Ever since his daughter died, he's not dared to show his face around anymore. The police should at least take him in. He never seemed, he never seemed anywhere close to being able to do things like that. I don't think he could ever do that, right? You can't be so sure about anyone now. Especially the, the people so close to it. I have to get back to work. Do what Mr. Afton told you to told you to do. Keep an eye on the on the dang children. Gosh. Guys, let's use some some proper language here. Okay, this is literally a kid's establishment. Y'all over here dropping D bombs. And G D bombs. Hmm? Looks like he's home. Skidamarink a dink a dink. Sk like the like the movie, Skidamarink. I love ye, I love ye in the morning, and then, I'm not singing that, I'm not singing that, it is a sound. <sighs> alright, <laughs> alright, is that Foxy, is he deeper in the cove? No, I wouldn't look that far, yo they finna, yo this might be thumbnail, hold on, please kill this so I can get a thumbnail. This isn't a thumbnail. This might be a thumbnail. Wait, what is this paper? Interact with Foxy? Ever since the incident with 86-1984. Ever since the incident with Ke Kenny, Fred Fred, 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 Fred Bear has been decommissioned and we need to make a new mascot. New concepts have set on my desk. Uh, oh, oh. Kenny, Kenny slash Sugar the Cat. Name undecided. Sparky the Dog. Rosie Porkchop. Porkchop? William suggested a clown girl. I think it's a subtle jab at his sister. Wow, that's rude. Leslie, a bear much like Fred Bear. Two names come to mind, Dead Bear and Freddy Fazbear. William also begged for a purplish, this music is so loud, begged for a purplish bunny with a suit. And when he said that, I suggested letting Vonnie rest since it would be weird for two bunnies in one restaurant. He got so aggressive as a result. Update, the bear's called Freddy. Initially, we now have two bunny mascots. How will we ever be able to explain the confusion now? Thanks, William. A few theming ideas came up for the future. One was aquatic and the idea prompted William to propose Roberto the Foxy. Roberto the Foxy? I just added a whole word. Roberto Foxy as a new mascot. What a terrible name for an interesting design made by his son, Michael. 
Another was Will's idea, which is a farm. The way he discussed it sounded like he was forcing a smile the whole time. Like it was something he was making to throw shade at something or someone. The last one was a Starlight Carnival. Wonderland type of vibe. With fantasy and fun come to life. But that fits the bill. Kids are going missing, just like they took you, took you from me, Charlotte. No parents should experience what I go through every day. Who would do this? I try my best to keep this place safe. I never took Vincent's gun after the incident to prove that any kid and grown up alike can be here. I know they convicted Emmett Tucker, but I know it wasn't him. And that whoever is responsible for Susie and Jeremy's disappearances is the same one that took Charlotte. Whoever it is, I'm gonna find you. Poor little boy. I thought you came here to see Foxy. Want a closer look? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Whoa. <laughs> that scared me. I cannot lie. Wow, that scared me. Oh my god, that scared me. That actually caught no. Great aim. That that actually scared the crap out of me. That okay, that scared me because it slid so smoothly onto the screen that I wasn't expecting it to happen. I was expecting like a rapid jump back at the cove. And then when it didn't happen, I was like, oh, maybe I'm safe. And then he slid onto the screen so like lifelike and it, it like threw me off. That's okay, that's that went kind of crazy. Oh. Start with the cutscene? Oh. Lonely Freddy. Well, I, I don't really question why you're alone considering the fact that you try to cut the power whenever your friends have fun. I would hope that you're lonely if you try to prevent your friends from having fun. Anyway. Uh box. Light. Door. Door. Uh, box. Since you hate those cameras so much, why don't we do something about it? Alright, what are you up to? I usually go through the vents to get here, but since I have you with me... Well, what do you mean? What difference do I make? Hey, f hey, Freddy told us not to do that. My Freddy's not here. All we gotta do is cut a couple wires and... Hello, was anyone there? Zoot Allures. It wasn't me, I didn't do anything. I'm just a boy. But what? Balloon Boy? Wait, what? Oh, you gotta catch him lacking. Oh, you gotta catch that boy lacking. All right, so, okay, okay. So you gotta catch him lacking at the red light or else you, you don't see cameras. You can technically live without cameras, right? Cause, well, no, cause the box. Hmm. Summer 18th, 1985. All right, this will be the last of the, the last night for this episode, right? Okay. Well, I need to first off figure out where Bloom Boy even is. I don't even see Big Bro- Oh, he's right here. Oh, I saw him the first time, I remember. I was like, how did I see him that fast? Okay, so if I just- Wait, that, that's Foxy? Oh, I'm stupid. I'm about to get killed. I'm about to get... Dude. You gotta get out the way. Oh, hi, hello. fast I can react to that, to be honest. Like, I don't know if, like, as soon as the clip plays...
I didn't see anybody else in that camera. What did I just hear? Please, go back to the door. Go back to the door. You close that door. Cannot leave my position, dude. This is so unfortunate. I gotta go, dude. Like, I literally gotta go. We're just in the other room. We just got to deal with this one world. y'all get while I'm quiet and I apologize for being quiet because I know you probably came here for some amazing oh, you guys probably came here for the amazing commentary that I totally provide on a consistent basis Unfortunately, I cannot do that at all. So, you're just going to sit here and wait. There we go. Okay. Sorry. I, I Dude, that game, this game requires you, like, some pretty decent attention. Like, you have, to, you have to put your, you know, you have to put effort into listening. So, for me to talk and listen is not happening. Especially when the sound effects aren't that much different from each other. God, I hope Miss Sutherland and Samantha don't get mad at me for this, but I can't leave my gang behind. You know they're here somewhere. Oh, buddy, I'm a solo. Gabriel, I know you're one of the most trustworthy characters around here, but how do I know you're not going to snitch to Mr. After and Uncle Henry? Dance. Sick moves. All right, I trust you. Is that? Are you serious? The puppet joined the gang. What? So you're telling me you saw a big slimy worm, big scary, scary, slimy worm in them bathrooms. Yes, it was dark, tall, and it had a mess like that one. Well, sounds to me like you done saw that darn puppet over there. I mean, honest, I never enjoyed that puppet thing. It's always thinking about some. It can go literally anywhere. Just waiting for my boss to get a phone call from the police about that thing. I don't think that's normal. You don't, you don't wouldn't get it. This accent's killing me.
Um, anyway. Interact with Freddy Plush. He's one of my favorites. The son is a real fun-loving guy. Almost as, pr as a parental figure, if that makes sense. He was Jeremy and Cassidy's favorite. They always fought for it. Sure has floppy ears and a cotton tail, though. I'll give him that. Susie loves her wholeheartedly. No matter if I had... No wonder, if I had something based on me, I would act like that too. They got her hunger correct. They got her hunger correct? My answer's singing voice. It's not so sweet. Interact with Cupcake. Cake. Bear. Fritz's favorite. Those unhinged and malicious kind of smelly one, which is the complete opposite of Fritz. I thought he was talking about Fritz. I don't know what he sees in him. Maybe he wanted to be as confident as him. I miss my little buddy. Yeah, he'd love Luffy. Interact with Hanged Doll. Oh, I know quite a bit about this plushie. He's from that place. Mr. After made a deal with some guy named Edwin. They wanted to... Whoa. They wanted to make the plushies to learn with other kids. To become their best friends by mimicking some of their actions. I wonder what the other plushies like these are. Check the counter. Seems like Roy didn't come in to work today. Never misses today, so I don't think he's coming back. What happened in the time? Other than Foxy, you know, getting a new captor. So want to be a substitute? I think I'm too young for this. Come on, Faraday, you can do this. I trust you. You're already all grown up. Dad, I'm like 19. And I still don't feel like I've moved on from, you know what? It was an accident. When growing up, slip-ups might happen. That's how it is. You have to move on from it. Sometimes, son, things just go missing. Oh. What? Yo, yo. Uh... Yo? Yo. Oh, it was good. It was good, gang. Yeah, I see y'all staring at me. Y'all see like y'all like my new cut. Um Oh. Alright, y'all staring a little hard now. Yo, can yo, can you guys can y'all get a little golden man away from me? I'm moving a little fast there. You guys don't have to look so hard? Jeez, you don't have to look so hard, especially. Goodness. You look like a craghead. Ew. Like a yellow craghead. So up till now, right? Hold on. The um, Okay. Is this implying that the other kids got off-screened, right? Because... How many have we seen? Have we seen a Chica child yet? I can't remember. I know we saw Foxy. We literally just saw it. We saw Freddy, didn't we? Cassidy's alive. Cassidy, I'm pretty sure, is supposed to be like one of the two souls in Golden Freddy, something like that. I don't know. Alright, well, anyway, right? With that, that brings us to night five. But we'll start knife up in the next video. If you like this video, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Please show you boys some love. Show you show the game some love. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.